Hi everyone. Um, today I wake up with a little bit mm, fear and um, my feelings was not stable and not nice. I started to think that all oh, my cells go bad and I need to <coughs> deal with how to get money, I need to uh, make my dreams become truth and um, you know I was unstable as much as possible I was unstable and I started to think okay yes I'm not in the best situation in my life and yes I was in the same situation before and I don't need to be so scared by this because yes it's normal situation sometimes it's happened but at the same time I started to think why I focus on this only like I don't see solutions or something but at the same time about one and a half year ago uh, was much more difficult situation and the idea that this yes it was difficult for me too but still I made it I was going for this and I handled this situation and after that I created uh, the sales on marketplace and I started to sell uh, very successful so it just appeared and I started to focus on um, such thing thought thought <laughs> that this is just a period and they need to deal with this just to focus how to handle this just to uh, analyze what you can do and after that do 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 and you will be successful you will find the way but what I want to say uh, when I came back to Russia after Mexico I also become mm, pretty much uh, not stable because uh, one part of me stay in Mexico one part of me stay in uh, Russia and I started to think what I want like where I want to live what I'm gonna do what I want to do and um, I understood that there is so many possibilities there is so many variants what to do and I'm interested to do a lot of stuff and I don't know how to focus on some of them and this is um, the most one part is the great thing you can do many stuff another thing is little bit scary like what to choose and uh, what to choose to not lose <laughs> and right now uh, when I came back I started to watch the videos with Joe Dispenza about his um, attitude how we produce our own anniversary our own life and that they need to focus on the future what we want to have in our future and to feel it like it happened already and we live in our future right now right here and I started to think that I need to focus on my goals but not what I have the problem right now yes I had them I don't say like oh it's not exist yes they exist and this is the problem for me right now but the focus have to be on the things what you want to have but not what you have right now because if you have right now and you focus on it uh, it's still like focus on the past and you will stuck on this if you wouldn't uh, try to find solutions if you wouldn't try to find uh, the ways how to deal with this problem so the best thing is to focus on your goal uh, the best thing to focus what you really want to have in your life and uh, I started to think that we really stop to dream uh, I started to ask my friends what they dream about and it was like unexpected um, question for them and they stuck like mm, what are you asking about like why are you asking this 
And I understood that they also start to think about what we dream about and what we want to have in our life. And this is a thing that what I see in all my friends, all my people who around me, they always talk on their problems, tasks of regular life and they are not enjoy their life right now, right here and they don't they forgot the, what they dream about. It's like you become adult and you stop to to dream. And this is so sad. This is sad that you can't come back to your dreams and start to make steps to this dream to become to make it uh, become truth. And I think that it's not fair to yourself to, s to forget about your dreams. And part of me understand that on my way it's so unusual for all my people who know me. They always trying to go the way through the way which pretty stable like they get a profession and after that they started to to create career to make family to to burn kids and so on and so forth they they stay in their uh, city or move to a bigger one and after that they stop and uh, for example they try to uh, buy flat apartment whatever and the thing is it's like it's not your dreams it's like someone said that this is the scheme for your life and you go through this scheme but what what happens the our dreams why they forget about our dreams and why we don't follow them why we don't make them truth because uh, if we remember biggest dreamers, they brought out uh, cars, iPhones and many, many, many stuff like Starbucks. All people creators of these companies, they were the dreamers and we create something special for us. Yes, for us right now it's something regular, but someone created this. And I started to think, why? We don't follow our dreams. Why we betrayed ourselves? And that's why I think that my period in my life right now, this is the breaking the board uh, between me and my dreams. Is this is the breaking um, board which don't allow me to go to my dream and I understand this is a really hard period for me I really need s support and I really need that people believe in me and I understand that I will cover all costs I will handle with all tasks and everything but I believe in myself and I know how much I created in this uh, life when I wanted, when I believed in myself. And this video for me right now, just to as a remind that whatever happened, you always handle with all your situations. Yes, it was hard, I know, but you need to focus on what you want, what you dream about. And you will got it. God. Not get. <laughs> so just believe in yourself and one day you will make your dreams become truth. Just keep dreaming. Please. Love you.